Hi guys! Hi! <laughs> Welcome back to Dunis Diary. Hi guys! Welcome back to Dunis. Why am I so excited? I get so very excited when I'm talking with you guys. Okay, I'll take another one. Hi guys! Welcome back to Dunis Diary. And on this channel, I talk about everything and anything. Literally, just exposing myself out there for you guys to see <laughs> so this vlog is going to be a little bit more serious than the usual vlog you see um this year 2021 i'm holding myself accountable for my finances most especially so we're going to be doing a little bit of a review and i'm also going to be working through um what i have planned for myself financially like steps that i want to take to just hold myself more financially accountable this year so i got myself a mind and money book planner do, 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 do this this <laughs> i already did like an unboxing video i'm gonna insert guys guess what's here my mind and money planner oh my god i'm so excited let's go for it oh my goodness oh my goodness <laughs> waiting this is wonderful the package i have been waiting for too long, I was so excited. It's one of the things that I got this year, um, early this year, and that I was really excited about because I really do want to take my finances more serious, like I have said. <laughs> you know, it's 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 all about where the money resides, you know, where the money resides. What a money reside, what a money reside, what a money reside. Basically all about that. But on a more serious note here, um I I also do like the idea behind the book. So I watched Patricia's bright um video when she explained what the book is all about you know what you should expect from the book as well and i also do like the idea you know you have a goal you have affirmation um you have a place where you write affirmation so we're just going to do like a quick review of what the book is we're just going to go through the first few pages and let you guys see what it's all about right before i go into this on normal day i use like a budget tracker like an excel sheet which i keep track of very diligently right but this year i want to do something different because i know that when i write down things particularly with pen and barrier there's this thing that happens when you write down things like you just know <laughs> you just you just it has a sense of accountability it's like you're accountable to what you've written down so you you have this notion of not um, failing yourself basically so 2021 is the year of taking charge taking charge because 2020 i had a lot of up and down with my finances there were some expenses that i couldn't just track there were some that I was like okay i think i deserve to spoil myself but i want to really take charge of my finances this year i want to invest more i also want to you know save more as well you know so the first the first thing that we're going to be looking at is um so you look at it like i got the pink i know there's the pink and the and the black but i got the pink and it really looks nice it has a branding here pb if you don't know or it has a break um branding here the break right i really like this unique very unique and i like the gold details as well on the planner and it had cover and it had like my damn money planner it's so nice and then the first thing i see is an explanation you know welcome to my damn money just a brief explanation of what this journal is all about basically the mind map god i really do need this mind map because i have a lot going through in my head right that i need to jot down probably you know try to get clarity of what i want to do this year um what i want to achieve so this mind map would act like sort of my vision board you know i know this is not the real um um what's it called explanation of what the vision board is but it's going to act sort of my my vision board and everything as that and then there's something that has to do with money moves what are my goals this year i'm going to write them down um actions i will take to reach my financial goals i'm also going to you know jot down some things as well um and then there's a saving tracker so my saving goals for each month total amounts what i've done i mean i really love this you know it's it has a lot of details to it and then you have the month monthly calendar you have 2022 as well um this is really nice i wouldn't i wouldn't even lie this is really really nice and uh, the investment tracker as well i have a couple of investments that i have invested in so i'm probably just going to write them down because sometimes i forget that i have investments <laughs> 
So I'm just going to write them down, put the amount invested. Mind you guys, I'm a very low risk um, taker when it comes to money. Very, very low. I consider myself, if there's something between medium and low, I'm probably in that middle. I really don't know how to give out a lot of my money. I rather just save, 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 which I know is not productive considering the times that we're in. And if I'm working towards building wealth, I really need to like increase my risk appetite in that regard and then we get to this page that talks about my affirmation for the month like what is the affirmation for what is my affirmation for the month you know it's it's it is nice a payment notification um social media notification versus social media notifications this is this is nice then there's a pre-monthly check-in uh what my financial goals what are my financial goals for the month um budget tracker i'm just really fascinated so we have this labels here by by the way um i think this is where you can actually put the months that i'm like when i start like the month so my affirmation for this month is good things come to those who stay consistent like maybe this will be february then for march you know there's something here the goal is to make an income while making an impact like the words of positivity this is this is nice and then this month's agenda making my dreams real reality like you're just keeping me accountable i really do love the book i really do love this planner it's quite heavy it's voluminous like it's a lot it's really a lot um to carry like i don't think i would take this on a day-to-day -day basis like i wouldn't carry this all along however it's something that i would have um maybe by my bedside just to keep me accountable like i said and you know just go back and see what it is that i really want to do you know because so i was talking to a friend recently and i just mentioned that i don't stick, keep tracks of my my um grocery shopping for example you know i just have in my head the limit i shouldn't spend or i shouldn't go below when i'm about to do my shopping but i think for record purposes and also just to be able to be more accountable to how i'm spending my money little details like that i really do need to take account for so based on that conversation i then realized that yes i'm going to you know take this more seriously There's so many inspiration around um getting my my financial business sorted out this year 2021 is the year we're making money moves Tru truly <laughs> money moves and i feel like for me to make that money move i have to start right now by you know getting my life sorted out you know being more organized in that regard uh, not to say that budgeting with an excel sheet is wrong or whatnot but personally i feel like um, in addition to the budget tool that I currently use, I need to have something written down in a notepad So That's why I, I got this as well. So yeah, let me know what you guys uh, are up to this year. Are you going to take your finances more seriously? You know, are you already in the steps of um, planning your finances? You know, do you have things that you're saving for that you like to track? I know this is quite pricey. It's about uh, 99 quid, I guess. I really can't remember, but I'll I'll leave it um, on the description in the description box below, uh, so you guys can see. It is like a good financial step. But let me know in your comment down below if you guys are actually taking steps towards um, finances and all of that. I know this this video is probably very serious, but yeah, you know sometimes we have to have that serious conversation, especially in the beginning of the year, and just set that tone for the year. What exactly you want to do but on a lighter note you know welcome if you're new to this channel uh, like i mentioned at the beginning of this channel i talk about everything and anything and if you like this kind of content please feel free to subscribe like my video and share with your friends you know share with everyone i'll see you guys in my next video bye I'll have a